For today's video, we'll be straying away from the usual topic of electronics, instead focusing on this unusual automotive product. The story behind how I got this was, a few months ago, when I was at the thrift store, I bought a package of incandescent bulbs. Now at my local thrift store, they tend to bundle various objects together in a bag for one price. I saw this thing bundled in, but had no idea what it is. The only English words I could see on the package are the manufacturer logos and the name Quick Park. Everything else on this box is in Dutch and French. Looking around this packaging, we can get an idea what this is and where it's from. So on the front, we have a sticker with the name Halfords and what I presume is the price. 9.95. Halfords is a UK-based auto accessory store, so it's interesting to imagine how this ended up in Canada. If we look at the back side, there is another sticker here. The two larger numbers on the bottom right, indicating 6.98, most likely indicate that this was sold on June of 1998 which would make this product exactly 25 years old. The car on the photograph, on the front of the box, is a 6th generation Toyota Celica, which would confirm that this is indeed from the 90s. I've translated all the text on this package using an online translator, so now we can go through exactly what this says. So at the very top, on the front side of the package, it says Parking is now very easy. It says the same phrase in French. It's worth noting that uh, all the phrases written on this package are both in Dutch and French, as I mentioned in the beginning, so it's not as much text as it looks, since there's two languages. Underneath Quick Park it says, estimate your parking to the last centimeters. Park your car without looking back. Fits any car in seconds. Success assured. This here, written in all caps, says, You have seen them on buses. Now there is a car version. And at the very bottom, right here, it says, Further details can be found on the back cover. Looking on the back cover, once again on the top left, it says, Parking is now very easy. In this first paragraph, it says, Just look into your rearview mirror and the quick park reverse lens will give you the same view as if you were on your knees in the back seat looking through the rear window without looking back. Is the parking space big enough? How often do you have to struggle to get into a spot only to find out when getting out that there was more room than you had thought after all? Now you can estimate down to the last centimeters how much space you have left Reversing becomes a second habit, no matter what kind of car you have to drive, sedan, hatchback, station wagon, you will find that there is no easier way to, to park. On the two images it says easy parking. After it says mounting instructions, one, place the lens on the inside at the top of the edge of the rear window about 15 to 20 centimeters from the center to the passenger side of the car. Make sure the window at that location is thoroughly clean and dry. Then remove the protective layer of adhesive. Then hold it in place for a few seconds. And two, adjust the lens so that it hangs vertically. And finally, in this last block of text, it says, using the quick park. When reverse parking and using the quick park, you can see the entire car behind you first, then the license plate, and then above it, the headlights and grille. When only the edge of the hood is visible, stop. Two, the same applies in the dark, since the car behind you is illuminated by your re reversing lights. And three, although you will soon get the hang of using the quick park, reversing should be done with care at all times. So that's it. As for text, uh, we've read everything that's on the box. 
So this is basically a reversing lens for your car. Kind of like an ultra wide lens for the camera where you can see a lot more from your surroundings. This is kind of the same idea. What I'll do next is carefully cut it out of its 25 year old sarcophagus and release that uh, 90s air into the room and we can get a better look at it. Okay, well it's been cut open now so we can pull it out of its packaging. Here is the uh, lens itself. And it genuinely does, yeah, check that out. So here's the mounting point. There's some adhesive tape. And that would mount to the top frame of your rear window. And when you do that, see it does that wide angle effect. Very nice. I'd imagine this would be quite useful nowadays as well. If you've got a car that uh, doesn't have a reverse camera, this could be quite useful. It seems to be made out of a nice plastic too. This is a uh, pretty high quality acrylic, I'd say. It's very clear. There isn't really any defects that I can see. Yeah. Quick park.